Oh, yeah, lads. I'm just, I'm enjoying the Orzov decks right now, so I'm going to try a little alchemy version. Let's give it a bash. You're still playing the first version of Alchemy Mono Black? Yeah, I'm just... I like the Blood Artist decks, man. They're pretty freaking cool. <clears throat> I'm in my Zoomer gear. <laughs> yep. I will say this. Hoodie is... Fucking boiling, man. It makes it very warm. <clears throat> Play with fire. Rahilda, okay. <clears throat> Alright, let's get the drainies started. <laughs> Been able to play four Rite of Oblivion and four Vanish and Verse. <clears throat> Honestly, it's a little bit OP. We could pass and get a life linker, but it would going to night seems pretty bad. <clears throat> you know what I'm saying, Jet? Going to night seems pretty bad. At least going to night intentionally seems pretty bad. Scalds, <clears throat> scalds into scalds. Okay, okay. Opponents popping. I just I don't really know if you want to go tonight, right? <clears throat> Going tonight with a curse seems a bit weird. I think you can just take your drainies and chill. <clears throat> Alright, please stop casting scouts. You fool. <clears throat> okay, gas. <clears throat> Their life total is going down, man. <clears throat> the Curse of Leeches is doing work. They're about to make some big creatures with the Scouts, but <clears throat> Rite of Oblivion, by the way. Very fair and balanced card. What the hell is this? <clears throat> Okay. It's a bit of a wombo combo. <clears throat> Weather announcement is is really good and they got a vanishing verse. Okay, I sleep. <clears throat> yeah. Weather announcement is very good and it's also very cool, man. It's also very cool.
easy blood artist attack to get a wedding announcement draw. <clears throat> I don't think we need the land, so save the land for the blood token. Angel fire ignition, man. Well, th there goes all my hard work with the curse of leeches. Ruined. Dude, stop hasting Rahildas. What the hell is this, this guy's problem? <clears throat> they have four more cards? Yeah, I mean, I think it's okay. Should be okay. I want my draw again off the wedding announcement, huh? <clears throat> but surely we win this game. Surely we win this game. Opponent has just played two Scalds, two Rahildas. That's all they've done, and they're kind of like, kind of in it. <clears throat> okay, that's also pretty good. I, I, just, I really like these Orzov decks, man. They're just freaking fun, aren't they? Probably should have disputed the treasure token before casting that, but... I mean, it's fine. <clears throat> Where's my removal, dude? Four rights, four verse, by the way. Two meat hooks, by the way. I guess we're happy to chill. <clears throat> Wanted to thank you for the standard Selesnia deck, you're having a lot of fun with it. The, the Augur one? It's a cool deck, man. I like it a lot. Okay. <clears throat> 22 lands in this deck, chat. Small... Small, tiny flood. <clears throat> tiny bit of flooding. To be fair, we have drawn like half of our deck though, so... <clears throat> Any hookies? <clears throat> you know what, chat? Right of Oblivion is goddamn fine. <clears throat> I think. I mean, they, they do have a lot of damage. Dude, how many? They're just holding three removal. What the fuck? <laughs> What the hell, man? <clears throat> I wasn't expecting that. Uh, okay. 
this is surely lethal. So hive, we attack for four. We verse the guy. We get through for four. We get through for five. Yeah, it's lethal, right? <coughs> No matter what, they, if they block the Blood Artist, it's lethal. If they block the 2-2, two, two, it's lethal. <clears throat> I mean, I also can just use Rite of Oblivion too. That's probably a good plan. It's lethal all kinds of ways. <clears throat> okay, good start. Good start to the Orzhov pile. That was a bit of a flood as well. We didn't really... We didn't see too many of our three or four mana cards in that game. That was that was mostly just one and two mana cards riding them to victory. I'm being, I'm being a little bit ambitious with this deck. I've got three ambitious farmhands and... Okay, I've got four planes. I thought I had three planes. Four, four is fine. To be honest, three is probably fine too, but at least this way, if we draw one planes, our farmhands are all still online. Curse versus werewolves? Maybe. Three mana, two, three is probably not going to do much. My hand kind of sucks here, though. I've got no three drop. Okay. <clears throat> Tapland. Freaking perfect. Good time to get it in play. Farmhand's such a sick creature to sack to your right as well. So Lolf dies when you cast her. Does Soren die when you cast him? That's the question. <clears throat> I sleep. She left back a 2-3 life link and flyer. Dude, the flyer is no joke. What the hell is this, man? Rebuke tribal. Dude, our deck is just so goddamn consistent, huh? <clears throat> like, you just spend your mana every turn. How are you supposed to lose?
we spend our mana again. Doesn't matter how many lands we have, we spend it all from turn one until the end of the game. GG's. That 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 was that was clean. Extremely clean. <clears throat> right of Oblivion is absolutely gas, yeah. <clears throat> you just need to make sure the downside to Right of Oblivion is that sometimes you can't cast it on curve, huh? So you just need to make sure you've got enough one drops that you can cast it on curve most of the time. I think I think ten one drops is probably enough to be able to do that, but I mean if we have to add more ghasts we can like cut some farm hands or something, I don't know. But we've played a one drop every game so far. City Stalker Connoisseur. I think it's pretty good, man. But... I would probably play it in this deck in best of three. But I think the Legion Angel's too good in best of one, right? To not play. Rakdos, no two drops, huh? <clears throat> What's your hiring multiple DevOps engineers and engineering managers? <clears throat> okay, what does that mean? What what would that be for? They're hiring more technical people to work on the game. Yeah, again, but what does that actually mean, you know? <clears throat> it's for process improvement. Okay. So they're not adding they're not they're not adding features, they're making the game run better. I mean anything good is good, I guess, but I cannot tell you how much I want. I'm I'm dying for spectator mod. But honestly, if they can, if they add spectator mod to the game, I will hold tournaments like every weekend. I I will take over the tournament scene in this game. But it's so much effort without the spectator mod that I I don't have time to do it more than like how much I'm doing it right now. But. I will hold multiple thousand dollar prize pools every weekend if they just add a fucking spectator mod. <clears throat> so I'll ask. I'm not asking for much. <clears throat> What do I do with my plebs? <clears throat> I sacrifice them to draw cards. <clears throat> oh. 
Less than one percent of user accounts use spectator mode in Hearthstone. Did one not? You're missing the point a little bit. <clears throat> spectator mode does not exist so that ten percent of people can use it. It exists so that one percent of people can use it. And 10% of people can watch things of those 1% of people. You know? Maybe people don't actually use it in the client, but they interact with the game in some way, like watch a video or a stream or something that that's using that. <clears throat> So, what you're saying is, this dragon guy is still fucked, huh? Okay. That's good to know. Okay, I clear the board and draw three cards, I guess. Mm -mm. I, I don't really like this taking four damage a turn thing. Seems pretty bad for us. Oh my god. Goodness gracious me. <clears throat> well, chat. <clears throat> really seems quite hard to beat opponents lots and lots of dragons. Tyrant's so good and brawl. It's just an amazing card, man. <laughs> It's the best card in alchemy for sure. <clears throat> these these dragons have dealt sixteen damage to me without attacking. They they never attacked. They've dealt me. They've hit me for sixteen. Better than key? That key is... <clears throat> I don't know, man. Key is just a medium card, isn't it? We're getting app napped, chat. You looked into what's he hiring? They're hiring 13 people for Arena specifically. <clears throat> is there like dates on the adverts or something? Is, is that... Are they recent? You can link it. Go on then. I don't think keys. I think keys maybe probably the most overrated alchemy card. <clears throat> okay, I don't know if I trust that link. Chat, please click the link, and if you get a virus, let me know. <clears throat> Green house. Link is fine. General talent pool. Art. Cinematic animator. That sounds like a fun job. 
Digital Dungeons and Dragons. Is there a D&D &D online game? Associate producer, lead software engineer. But they don't have a lead software engineer? Visual effects artist, Pog. <clears throat> You're applying? Go on, read. Get the bank, mate. They need more lead software engineers. It's just an experience level title. Well, what would be what would be the tap the top? What's the top man or woman called? If not lead, I can't be. It's surely not just senior. I mean. Director of Arena. <clears throat> Get your applications in chat. The world needs you. Okay, <clears throat> that's an absolute yikes. <clears throat> I was there's a lot of group players on the on the alchemy ladder. Dude, I'll take a witch's oven. Hit me, baby. All right, <clears throat> I'm very much hoping that a meet out massacre for three. Next turn clears whatever board they have. Okay. Pog. This deck feels so nice, guys. It just it just plays so smoothly. <clears throat> Seems to be light on wild cards as well. Uncommon, uncommon, common. Uncommon, uncommon, mythic. Uncommon, rare, 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 mythic. That's not too bad. <clears throat> What is pretty bad is the opponent's unlimited reckless storm seekers.
Time to abuse witches up in chat. Kind of. <clears throat> I like this deck only plays 22 lands and we just find them so consistently well with all the draw and I mean you can f even more consistent in this version than the standard version because of the brush stroke huh I think I was I'd rather save the food token than the blood token. Sack your treasure, keep your food. <clears throat> Reduce to memory. Reduce to memory will be good for getting out rid of like planeswalkers, ranger classes, flyers. <clears throat> I can also. I can turn like my food token into a 3 2 guy, huh? I think. Should be able to. <clears throat> Oko at home. Hey. It's not the worst thing in the world, is it? Vanishing verse. Dud. What's your problem? <clears throat> what the hell is your problem? I maybe, I maybe should have played that pathway as a black. I, I don't think it's going to make too much difference, but... Alright, we've got two food tokens. I'm on three life, which is very spooky, but... Game looks okay. <clears throat> Worst fights, but I think the inscription is really good. It, it only really sees play in mono green, and <sighs> I don't know, man. I I I played one in grill, and it was really good. Winnable Cropium? I don't know about Cropium. Looks pretty winnable. Have you tried the one mana clue that drafts a card? Uh, no. <clears throat> a 
I'm not really sure how that can be good though. It's kind of sick, guys. It feels like even though we're on 3 life, we're actually on infinite life. <clears throat> it becomes night. Plus one, plus zero, trample. Whenever this deals combat damage to a player, draw a card. Okay, small yikes. <clears throat> but only a tiny yikes though. That's the easiest triple block of my life on this Rahilda. They have a verse? They do, yeah. Why do you think I'm triple blocking, mate? It just it feels so good to win these kind of games, huh? When you're on when you're on three life and you start to slowly take control of the battlefield. <clears throat> slowly but surely. <clears throat> nice verse, mate. I'll activate my witch's oven to make a food token, draw a card. <clears throat> I'll take a second oven for the cat that I'm going to get off of this witch. <clears throat> I'm pogging. I'm officially pogging. Opponent is not going to be happy about this. Two to a cat. Oh shit. Finally, it's been buffed. Is that lethal? What is two plus two? Four. <clears throat> okay. What now, gruel boy? <laughs> Two mana, three, three, or endless three threes that drain. I know which side of the battlefield I'd rather be on. <clears throat>
Look, cat cat oven is it is broke. Seriously. Eldrain was fine, by the way. <clears throat> Catavan is like... No matter how powerful Eldrain was as a set, generally, Catavan's one of the most strongest things from it. It's very, very crazy. <clears throat> Are there any, are there any cat oven regulars left in the chat? <clears throat> I'm seeing less and less people playing cat oven, but I hope there's I hope there's still some people out there living the glory days. Always up, was and always will be broke up. <clears throat> it is extremely goddamn strong. You ain't wrong. <clears throat> Weren't the glory days the days of Agent Yori and Luca? I mean. Luca Fires was a very strong deck, but, you know, it, it was never the coolest deck, you know? It's highly whatever. It, it was extremely powerful, and you felt like a bit of a god when you were popping off, but... No Thalia off your captain, please. <clears throat> Opponent's deck looks highly familiar to my eyes. <clears throat> Do you know what else is familiar? Playing Naya werewolves and dying to a meat hook massacre. <clears throat> Why did they haste not the wolf? David, come on. At least play the deck right. Fuck me. Why would you not haste your wolf? Should we play the eye twitch? Yes. <laughs> Next turn is like farmhand and either brushstroke or announcement. <clears throat> Probably just announcement. Brutal Cathar. What a card. What a card. Mr. Crook, I like your shirt today. Thank you. I got this hoodie from uh, Wizards of the Coast. Our good friends. They sent it to me. So I thought I'd... I thought I'd whack it on on my uh, card reveal day. Seems like a good day for it. It says... I don't know if you can see that, but it says Kamigawa on it. 
Kamigawa Neon Dynasty, which conveniently is the name of the next set. It's funny how things work out. <clears throat> All right, GG's. <clears throat> I just, dude, I just really like these Orzov decks, man. They're so, uh, like, because they're so consistent, they're just so fun. <clears throat> I mean, you really want to get your wedding announcement going, but giving them a Valkyrie turn is, you know, my old spook. <clears throat> but to be honest, casting Vanishing Verse is pretty game losing here, isn't it? <clears throat> it makes this turn inefficient, it makes next turn inefficient. I'm not scared of their deck. I'm going to play my own deck. There's no way to get to 27 next turn. I think they can get to 27 pretty easily with a captain, right? Mardu. <clears throat> Mardu, huh? Very interesting choices there. <clears throat> What's the red for? Hoffrey. Ah, I see. I'll be honest. I, I know that Hoffrey does some cool stuff with clerics, but I don't I don't actually know what it does. It's kinda weird. We go to six, chat. <clears throat> we go to six. <clears throat> but we're beginning to turn the game. Kind of. Maybe. What? Play the veteran. Play the veteran instead of using your pyre. <laughs> You're a full opponent. <clears throat> You're an absolute fool. <clears throat> What's that about?
<clears throat> Alright, this game's gonna be hard, guys, but... You can always rely on me to try my very best. It's all under control, chat. It's all under control. <clears throat> Hold. I'm trying, man. I'm really trying. <clears throat> What I would really like to do is get the opponent to, like, exactly 26, huh? They're going to tax my bat. <clears throat> Alright, we drain for six. <clears throat> Honestly, this is an easy win, isn't it? Actual easy win. Getting a flyer? Or getting the, the tutu, I guess? Nice pyre. I would like you to drain yourself for three every time you use it, mate. Uh, Pyre is sorcery speed, sadly, for the opponent. <clears throat> nice 1 3 life linker. Would be a shame if I played a 4 mana 3 3 flyer drain 2. <clears throat> next turn, chat. Next turn, we coven. Three vanishing in a row, Wizards wants you to win. Well, I mean, dude, there's a reason I'm playing four Right of Oblivion and four Vanishing Verse, and it's it's not because I, I don't want to draw them, you know? <clears throat> I play eight copies so that I get to use them every game. Don't think you've seen me enjoy a deck this much in a long time? I just, really, I just love this type of deck, man. <clears throat> I'm not a... I'm not nearly as interested in, like, you know, the four Blood in the Snow, four Meat Hook Massacres, ten Planeswalkers version, but... <clears throat> Going off with all these tokens, I mean, it's just fun, isn't it? It's just frickin' fun. What a card, dude. What a friggin' card. <clears throat> Hoffrey, see you later.
There's not... He could get rid of the pyre too, I guess. Fine. I'm not sure the pyre is actually that much of a threat, but... It helps them a little bit, I guess. <clears throat> I know I can transform farmhand, but... I attack for three, opponent attacks for one life link. It's a fair deal. <clears throat> we do not need more than six lands, so we'll just save any other lands for some uh, blood tokens. Second pyre. So lucky. That seems good. <clears throat> Is that game? But that's like twenty damage or something. The deck is just so smooth, man. So smooth. <clears throat> It hits land drops, it spends all its mana, it wins the game with no cards left every time. It's fucking beautiful. <clears throat> I'm in love chat. Actually in love with the deck. Yeah, that they they really need to change Blood Artist to just hit the opponent, huh? <clears throat> Self targeters with Blood Artist will be in a shambles, but you know, that's probably one man out there in the void somewhere. Adeline, but dude, I'm telling you, I will I will add Adeline after this game. Before, the, before we start the next game, there'll be an Adeline in the deck. I guarantee you. I promise. That is the easiest double block of my life. What the hell was that? <clears throat> okay. <clears throat> I looked. <laughs> Ha ha ha! What a fucking play. <clears throat> what a play. <clears throat> that was a pump spell, yeah. Plus three, plus one. On your turn, trample on opponent's turn, first strike. Interesting card.
two mana. Yeah, I mean, if it was one mana, it would be a little bit good, though, don't you think? <laughs> Maybe not. Maybe it's fine at one mana, but... Plus three, plus one, trample on your turn, first strike on opponent's turn for one. It's a little bit spooky. Very interesting choices here, chat. All three are okay. It's a little bit late for the curse, like they've kind of played all their creatures, huh? <clears throat> but... Yeah, maybe curse is still best. I, I mean, curse is definitely the best if it's turn two, but it might still be okay. <clears throat> Dude, wedding festival, <laughs> the card is insane. Good lord. I cannot wait to play wedding festivity and the rat yoinker saga in the same deck. I am going to go off, go off. Standard will be a mess. Well, I'm going to solve it in, on day one, baby. Day Juan. <clears throat> <clears throat> Very interesting attacks from our little buddy over here. Wow. Okay. Alright, are we versing the ranger class or are we holding? I mean, the Rahilda is also relatively sketch. Okay, running out of cards a little bit here, but it's not too bad. <clears throat> Still got both of our meat hooks to draw, which is nice, I guess. <clears throat> and we can kill everything. Holy, did they can post combat pump their ranger class, huh? It's pretty good. Opponent doesn't stop. Opponent ain't stopping. They shouldn't have too many ways to gain life though. Maybe maybe like one copy of inscription. <clears throat> so hopefully all we have to do is deal another eleven damage to win. Okay. <clears throat> we might be dying, chat. <clears throat> Alright, not sure what that does, but we've got to top deck it. 
probably does something, right? <clears throat> Anybody in the chat down to smork for four here? Any smorkers? It's pretty bad to smork, isn't it? So it's a very interesting spot, man. So if I smork for four, I take ten. That's just a bad deal. <clears throat> That's no matter how you spin it, that'd be a bad deal. Tovolar top deck. I sleep. It's pretty good to me. That's pretty fucking good to me. Pretty fucking good to me. They're telling me they're going to draw three cards. <clears throat> Honestly, that's a bit unfair. Is top deck better? <clears throat> I mean, right is nice, but okay, minus one. What a game, man. What a game. What a game. How about you top deck a land, Gruel Boy? <laughs> so bad. What a fool. <clears throat> what an absolute fool. So we can sack we can sack the curse to go back today. The curse is kind of nice though, huh? When they're on seven life. But nighttime is real spook, spook city. We may actually, we might even be able to get a draw next turn with the Hive and the Tutu.
Honestly, Rite of Oblivion is quickly becoming my favourite card. <clears throat> it's, a, it's a very cool card to use. <clears throat> All right, chop. Ecuador. Ecuador. <laughs> <laughs>